Champions of Norath, thank you for answering my call in what may be our darkest hour. The unthinkable has happened. Orcs and goblins, once mortal enemies, have now become allies and attacked our beloved home in Fadewer. Even as we speak, they move through Fadark Forest unopposed. They have pillaged our home, Kelethin, and put our loved ones to the sword. Their tracks leave scars upon the land that may never be healed. A welcome sight indeed. It will take all my strength to protect Fair Caliphin from the Orcish hordes. Lift is off limits by order of Leith Corius, Heartwood Master of the Wood Elves. So, you're off to slay the raiders, are you, hmm? Well, my hat's off to you. I gave up the adventuring life centuries ago to open this shop.
Who has provided these holy woods? Aren't you a little overdressed for a stroll through Fadark Forest? And maybe you haven't heard, but we're fighting orcs today. Your words are wasted on this one, Eodane. It's but another fool who thinks to be a hero. When will Lithgorius stop sending them to us? They don't come prepared, they don't follow orders, and they don't bathe. They're more trouble than they're worth. Mark my words, we'll end up burying this one right next to the others. With your charm, Havnal, it's little wonder we don't get more recruits from Fadox champions. You will have to excuse my friend, but he does have a point. If you're here to do battle with the orcs or goblins, you'll need to better equip yourself. Equip with what? We haven't got any extra provisions. The goblins took everything they could lay their hands on. You might as well go home. The Heartwood Master would not be pleased to hear his warrior welcomed with such words, Coel. This knight has traveled a long way to do battle at my father's request, on behalf of our people. Forgive Coel's words. These have been difficult times for us all. I am Elgoain, lieutenant in the Fadark Battalion and son of Lethkorius. You are welcome here among us, champion. I see my father chose wisely, indeed. You could not have come at a better time. If you wish to arm yourself with better weapons and armor, then it may be that we can aid each other. Beyond the rock grotto are two fallen trees which mark the goblin's cave. In this cave, you will find the spoils the goblins plundered when they sacked our home of Kelethon. In exchange for spilling goblin blood, you may also find other things there which could be of great use to you on your mission.